I followed a local dachshund rescue group and a relative of Obi's former owners reached out to them. They said it was a 70 pound dachshund, the equivalent of a 600 pound person. Okay. When he arrived, I was like, oh my gosh, he is big. Obi was physically in pain and unable to move. His chest was so wide that his little feet were pushed out to the side, like little flippers almost. It was time to get help for him. I knew that Obi was used to eating mostly people food, and I knew about commercial diet that was specially formulated for overweight management. You had to focus on losing the right type of weight because you wanted him to maintain a good body mass, but yet lose the fat. And the nutritional approach is to use a diet that is a high protein to calorie ratio. And what that does is it actually helps Obi maintain lean body mass, but protein actually stimulates the metabolism. I think the key to getting a dog to lose weight is you have to be more stubborn than them. <laughs> he did not eat for the first two days that I had him. He really just threw a fit about it. And I was like, well, I'm sorry, but you have to eat dog food now. And I tried putting chicken broth on it. I tried carrots and he wanted nothing to do with carrots. I knew that if he was hungry enough, he would eat. But once he started eating dog food, he never looked back. He was able to lose 1.35 pounds per week for 52 weeks. So slow, safe, effective weight loss, which is where Nora came in, is what's important. You never want to lose weight really fast. When he was about 38 pounds, Obi still had weight to lose, but his skin was so loose that every step he would take, he would step on it, and it just kind of got in the way. It was time to get that excess skin off. So I decided to have Obi's skin reduction surgery. With the increased activity and actually being able to go for walks, he would then lose the remainder of the weight. I actually was there for his surgery. They removed two and a half pounds of skin that day. He was eating by the morning, and I took him out for his first walk after surgery. He wagged his tail, and he was great. Twenty-one pounds. Obi is 14 and a half years old now, and I think his life has absolutely been improved and extended beyond what it would have been without any intervention. And the fact that he remained healthy through all of it is pretty phenomenal. Obi has definitely changed my life. He's an amazing dog. He's taught me a lot and he's brought a lot of people into my life. Obi Dog Journey is his Facebook page. There are a lot of fans. I mean, these people, they love Obi. I got messages from obese people who were inspired to lose weight because of Obi, and he certainly brought attention to obesity. There are a lot of obese pets, and Obi has inspired them to lose weight too. And he did decide that he loves carrots after all. So it all worked out. <laughs>